up guys, it's Value Instinct and welcome to my setup. So I guess first off I'll start with my PC. So the GPU is a 1050 Ti, the CPU is an AMD FX 6300, 2TB uh, hard drive and 16GB of RAM, but it is DDR3 so it's kind of slow. Moving on, on top here I just have a bunch of stickers of my logo, they're custom made by Sticker Mule, they're like a dollar or something. Uh, over here I have a Razer sticker. I have them everywhere in my setup, so yeah. I have also another one, it's kind of hard to see, and then along with my logo. So moving on to my mouse pad, I have a Razer Goliath Extended Chroma. This thing is giant, it's like, I think it's like three feet. So I have my mouse that came with the PC. I don't really know what mouse it is called. But this is a pre-built PC, it's the Cyber GUA 600, I believe. And then moving over here, we have the remotes to my LED lights, which are behind my monitor. Obviously I have blue for value, so value up. Moving over here to my speakers, I have the Razer Noma Chroma, and I also have my headset on my speaker as a headset stand, so that's 200 IQ play right there. Um, I don't really have any cable management, but I don't really care. Um, cables all over just don't bother me at all. Moving on to my keyboard, I have the Razer Sinosa Chroma. I got this for like $30. I got a really good deal on Amazon. So yeah, that is that. Moving on, I ha I just finished this banner. Actually, this header, I should say. It, uh, it took seven hours, um, and Photoshop and Magic Bullet looks kept crashing on me. But speed R on this coming soon. Uh, there's all the layers and everything. So yeah. Also, this monitor is 144 hertz, one millisecond response time, and 1080p. All right. So also, there's my other speaker. So I have two of them. I have one on the right and one on the left. Moving on, I have the Blue Yeti. This microphone is really good. A lot of people have it. Now I don't really have a mic arm just because I'm fine with the basic mic stand. If it does get in the way, I usually just push it back to my speaker, but it's not too big of a deal. I don't really want to have a giant mic arm in my setup, that's just me. Moving on, I have a few Rubik's Cubes right there. I used to cube a lot, but I don't really cube anymore. So I guess moving on, I have my G Fuel Tower. My favorite is probably Strawberry Banana and Watermelon. Watermelon is down here, kind of hard to see. All these flavors are really good except for Sour Blue Chug Rug. It's just too sour for me and too strong for me. I don't really like that much, but everything else is good. Moving on, I just have a bottle of water because I'm thirsty and a coaster. And then I have three G Fuel Shaker Cups. I have the Apex Phase and then just a regular one. Alright, so moving on, I have a shark in a jar. This is probably the most interesting item I have on my setup. So I got it in 2008 in New York City. Uh, so he's been in there for like 12 years now All right, so also that's my uh, my mouse pad like the guidebook There's a G Fuel sticker. I have another one right there. It's just sitting on my desk not really doing anything I also have just basic Apple Headphones that come with the iPhone. I have uh, these are the G Fuel cans They're in the box because I just kept the box for decoration then I also, again, that's the box in my Rubik's Cube. And then there's a fourth G Fuel Shake Cup, but this one is just a pen holder, pen and pencil holder. And that's pretty much it, my setup, guys.